Okay, how's it going guys? Welcome back to some more Pokemon Eternal Order. Let's uh, continue on. Ooh, a lovely charm. I don't know what that does. What does that do? Oh, it powers up fairy attacks. Well, we can give that to Jigglypuff. It's not too bad. Power up that twinkle hit. Is there an item back here? No. Interesting. Pikachu for Pachirisu. Even if I had a Pikachu, I would not make that trade. What are these? Charty berries. Mine now. I train my Pokemon here daily. This is like my main domain. Starts off with a War Turtle, not too bad. Can I get boosted special? Nope. It's fine. 15 a hit. Okay, it's a three shot. Oh, he's a shell bell. What? I mean, it's fine. Should be able to knock him out here. Ooh, we got a good hit there. I'm dead. It sucks. But maybe there's a chance we survive. Alright, what is this Pikachu gonna do to me? Uh, I don't know. Let's go to Rotom and go for... Do I just want to go to Rotom and go for Uproar? I guess we can try it. We're faster, so that's a good thing. Does nine, that's not too bad. It's gonna take four hits to knock him out though. Please hit. Oh wait, double team boosts speed? Wait, what? Okay, that's interesting. No longer boosts evasiveness, it boosts speed. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, you want to learn Shockwave. Let's get rid of Double Team. I want to keep Flash for now, because again, it boosts special attack every turn. So that's good. I want to keep that. Oh, I'm locked in. That's not good, because this is a Dark type. Oh god, we're still locked in. Okay, he's not hitting me, which is a good thing. I don't know. Can he not hit me? Maybe? Okay, I don't think he I don't think he can hit me. He might only have normal attacks. So that's good. Ooh, revive. Speed Citrus, not bad. A 
another revive. All right. I'm one with the wind. You can't touch me. Okay, well. What are the chances he only has fighting attacks? Oh god, he went for Meditate. If this thing has a dark attack, I'm I'm in a bad spot. Oh wait, I didn't oh wait, never mind. Good hit. Twinkle hit! Oh, we survived it though. Was not expecting that. Okay. Nice. Good hit. I give, I give. Let me check all these rocks. I feel the desert's air pumping me with energy. Doka. Whoa, 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 whoa. First off, Shiny Dodua looks amazing. Second off, what is that typing? Is that ground flying? Oh my god. That's a really cool typing. Hmm, I think that's only weak to water and ice, I think. Okay, well, at least that's not stab. Okay. I was worried he might have a ground attack, but he doesn't. And we destroyed him. Oh, man. Yeah, there was no way I was faster. If he two hits... Dang it, he had to get a third one in there. He had to get the third one. All right. Um... Then we go Jigglypuff, go for Twinkle Hit. Two. Three. Can I get four? We got four. Let's go. Easy. Should be fine. One, two, okay. Think we need four more to finish him? Maybe three? Of course we get another two hit. Is that our rival? I think it is. I should probably go heal before I uh, get into this encounter.
Okay, let's do this. Hey Mark, looks like you're struggling to get through this desert too. How strong did your Pokemon get? Mind if you show me? Alright. Good thing I went back to heal. Alright, four Pokemon. First up is a Mimikyu. Oh, that is horrifying. Okay, let's bust the disguise. Let's go for one more charge beam. If this does less than half, we'll use Psy Beam next. If it is more than half, then we'll use it again. I did nothing. Okay, uh, I think we gotta try to knock it out, so we'll go for Psy Beam. Actually, let's go for a cover. I think we'll just charge beam recover until we knock it out. Okay. What are we right now? I think we're either plus three or plus four. Either way, we're in a good spot. Dang it. Okay, that's fine. Let's go to Shellos. Water Pulse. Grottle. This thing learn a ground attack this early? I don't know. I know it learns Earthquake like when it evolves at 32. But I don't know if it gets one before that. Hopefully it doesn't. I don't even think we can knock it out with Ember. This thing's pretty thick. Yeah, I don't... He might knock us out first. That is a lot. A Seed Bomb does so much damage. How does this thing have Seed Bomb that's like base 80 and I have M... Oh, we knocked him out. Let's go. All right. Well, never mind. There we go. Easy. Confuse Ray. I don't think I want to learn that. Actually, let's get rid of Ingrain. 
I don't really like ingrain. It's not as good as like recover. Perhaps my last move wasn't the right one. Well, never mind. Hey Mark, did you know that the daycare center is near Gallia City? Trainers sometimes leave their Pokemon there to be raised by their caregivers or to breed for stronger Pokemon. Here, if you want to go to the daycare, then perhaps this item will come in handy to you. The Oval Charm. Isn't that a pretty charm? It is said that this charm increases the chance of an egg being found at the Pokemon daycares or nurseries. Oh, Gallia also has a gym too, right? I guess that's why you're heading there. Well, I'll see you later. How's my team looking after that battle? Uh, pretty beat up. I don't think we'll be fine if we continue forward. I'm just, uh, just get like a super potion on my Tor Cat. We'll be fine. Oh, we got a flying gem. Nice. Places such as these are perfect exploration places for ruin maniacs such as myself. Okay. Craney dose. I do have bulldoze. Are we faster though? Should I go for bulldoze or double kick? Probably bulldoze, because it can at least lower speed. Just in case we weren't faster. Oh, we went for Pursuit. Well, it's a good thing we didn't switch out there. Nice. Tyrant. Dang. Oh, God, okay. Um, let's swap out here. No, I meant to, oh, we went for Bide. Wait, I think we finish. Oh, I don't know actually now. Oh, geez, I don't know if we finish. I don't think we're going to do enough to knock him out. Should I risk it? I'm going to risk it. I'm going to go for double kick too. Come on, critical hit. Oh, let's go. Just enough, dude. That was risky. Paid off, though. Good stuff. I found this sunstone while exploring some ruins the other day. Perhaps you can find some use for it. That's pretty cool. I need a moonstone, though, not a sunstone. Just in case. Let me check to see if this is used, if I can use this. I doubt it, but you never know. Yeah, no. Alright, that's fine. Just thought I'd check. What the heck? Why are you guys blocking this path? Our leader seems to take his time inside the desert ruins. Oh, okay. Uh, I should probably go heal before we go in here, so I'll see you in a bit. Okay, we're ready. Ooh, it's dark. Um, I don't think anybody knows Flash. I got rid of Flash for uh, for Charge Beam. I think for now we can teach it maybe to Jigglypuff, get rid of like Grass Knot temporarily, just so I can see. Much better. Ooh, armor fossil. That is shield on, right? And a rock gem. Two red shards.
skull fossil that is Cranidos. Hello? The two Pokemon that controlled life and death. If they fell, if they felt into someone's control, could that someone gain the power to bring order into this world? It's you. You're that child who stopped a grunt of Team Arsenic grunts from robbing a bank. It took a child to bring justice upon a few criminal lackeys, something which not even the police was competent enough to do. Still, you are to be praised for your actions. Do you know what these ruins are? History indicates that these stone tablets were written by a society tens of thousands of years old. It is believed that these writings are praises made to honor two Pokemon with great power. Power that they gained by either absorbing life or bestowing it. What I believe is that the people of this society had more respect for those Pokemon they worshipped them out of fear. It was the fear of their power that caused people to obey and praise those Pokemon. It was what created order between them. That's what I believe. Anyway, my name is Xenon. I too am a Pokemon trainer. Your name is Mark, right? Mark, I want to see how you and your Pokemon fight in a battle. How powerful the bond between you and your team is. I'm quite intrigued to find out more about it. Now, if you don't mind. Okay. He's only one Pokemon. And it's a level 25 type null. All right. Wait, if he only has normal attacks, uh, so much for that. Now watch him have, like, bite. No, I don't think he can touch me. If that's the case, then we win. Yeah, he <laughs> literally can't touch me. He is mm, Crush Claw, Double Hit, Scary Face, and... For some reason, Metal Sound, which I think lowers my special defense. Is that correct? Yeah. So. Oh, that's that. That is enough. I understand now. What happened in Walshin City was no fluke. You're a talented trainer indeed. And I sense no evil intent from you, either. Ah, excuse me. Your Pokemon are harmed. Let me heal them up for you. Here. I found this Pokemon in this desert not too long ago. It was weak and battered when I stumbled upon it, but I managed to nurse it back to normal health since then. Don't consider it a bribe or anything, but judging by your axe committed back in Walshin City, I think you're a trainer worthy of raising it. What is it? Ooh, it's a Larvesta! I would use that if I didn't already have a fire type. Now please, let me pass. Okay, is there anything in here? No, can I escape or out of here? Should I read the wall first? Uh, I can't read the wall. Alright. Please tell me this works. Nice.
Rare bone. Cool. I want to catch some new Pokemon, but I don't want to get sand all over me. What? Why are you in a desert? Oh my god, that shiny gloom. That is not a good start. Let us go to... Torca? Still got to watch out for its poison attacks, like acid. Ooh. Didn't really need the burn there, but I'll take it. Pachirisu, Bulldoze. Round. It's not bad. That'd be 90. 90 fairy attack. Special. Yeah, I think that's better. Oh, that did so much damage. I'm thinking what I should turn my Rotom into. Well, well, we wouldn't go for Heat, because we have a Fire type. We wouldn't go for Wash, because of Shellos. I'm thinking Mow. No, we have a Grass type, too. Then Freeze. I think we might turn into Rotom Freeze. I don't think I've ever used Rotom Freeze. Hmm. Like, in order. I think my favorite is Wash, followed by Mo. Well, oh, you want to learn Fire Fang. Yes. That's a huge upgrade because you're a physical attacker. It'd go Wash, Mo, Heat, Freeze. What's the, what's the flying one called? Is it Fan? I never use that one because it's kind of pointless. Because it's a flying type with Levitate. I heard there are some ruins around this desert. Have you seen them? Uh, yep. This guy has four Pokemon. First up is a Weepin' Bell. You really went for Sleep Powder. Have you no shame? At least we got cured from Blaze, but... Oh, we one-shotted it. Nice. I didn't think I was going to do that. Let's go. Nice. Get that Storm Drain boost. And then go for Mud Bomb. Oh, he's rolling out. That is dangerous. How much damage are we doing? Not a lot. Lovely. Please miss. Okay, we finished him. Good, 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 good. That was scary, dude.
Ha! Ah, <laughs> uh, that's funny. Water poison. So not dragon. Good. Good. Good game, good game. Oh, there's a town. Nice. Let's go heal up. Ooh. The other end of this route is the Ranger Department and the entrance to the Celia Tunnels, which leads to Gallia City. Cool. Calfane evolves into either Tauros or Miltank, depending on its gender. But if your male Calfane levels up while inside the Fiery Meadow, it'll evolve into a Bufalant instead of a Tauros. Okay. So we gave those Pokemon a pre-evolution. Interesting. Very interesting. What's over here? Four yellow shards. Not bad. Alright. Don't want to hop that. Maybe I do. This is my special training place. Come train with me. That's unfortunate. Try it. I dare you. Oh, he went for Whirlwind. What? Was not expecting Whirlwind. Oh, it's I shouldn't be using Fire Fang. This thing has thick fat. Oh, well. Ooh, clutch burn. Very clutch. Probably would have knocked us if it wasn't burned. This is very risky. <laughs> it's probably a horrible idea. This is a horrible idea. Can he go for Mock Punch? No, he doesn't have Mock Punch. I flinched? Oh, no. Please? Let's go. Surprised he didn't have Mock Punch. Okay, cool. Woo, I'm full of energy. Ditto. Oh, okay. Um, and I missed. Lovely. I mean, he can only hit me with Mud Bomb, too. He even tries going for Water Pulse. I get a boost.
Oh, it's still raining. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's still raining. That's unfortunate. Okay, rain stopped. I should be able to finish him here then. We're good? Yes. Perfect. Woo. Are citrus berries. Oh, yes, dude. The scent desert flowers give off. The scent desert flowers give off is quite unique, isn't it? We finally have access to citrus berries. That's huge. Ooh, shiny sun flora. That looks really cool. Um, Torcat, because you're probably going to go for a grass attack. My guess is Mega Drain. No, we went for grass knot. Okay, I did not expect that. Good hit. Good hit. And good hit. Nobody's gonna stand in the way of my Torah cat. He's too one he's too good. I will take these. Definitely might end up planting some of these and just like, you know, farming them. So I can have a bunch whenever I need them. Let's go heal. What an interesting aura. Let me see how far the extent of your power can lead you. Okay. What the heck? Cutleo. It's a male version of Curlia. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh my, he's going for Force Palm. Wait, what? Oh, he has Trace. Oh, that, okay. I just realized he has Trace. Well. Can he not hit me? He has, he has Return and Force Palm. Oh, no, he has Disarming Voice. Okay. Yeah, it's fine, though. Gotharita. Ooh, they made Gotharita Psychic Dark. That's interesting. Please finish. Oh no, I'm dead. I survived? I survived by a good good margin. What the heck? I guess it's a special attacker and he used a physical dark attack. That's probably what it was. Mistrevis is Ghost Fairy. What? That's kind of cool. Now I'm going down. No, I survived again. Let's go. Rotom's too powerful. I keep surviving these hits. I think that I think I think you're gonna knock me out, but I just survive. It's awesome. What is this thing gonna do to me? Don't mirror coat. 
don't mirror coat? He mirror coated. Okay, well. Yeah, it's fine. Um, let's go to... Let's go to Torquette and just use Bite. You're even more powerful than I predicted. Hold it. Witness the power of this magnificent stone. Dang it. I was hoping it'd be a moonstone. That's unfortunate. Okay. Um, I think before we continue on, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode off here. And we will continue next time. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.